If you've been wanting to use cart flows without a page building tool and instead use the built-in page building tool that comes with WordPress called Gutenberg, I have great news for you because we fully support Gutenberg with cart flows. Let me show you how you can use it. Go to the cart flow settings and I'll click right here. Then when we scroll down, there's this option here that says show templates designed with and then there's a drop down box. I'm going to click here and I'm going to choose Gutenberg and then I'll click on save changes. Okay. Now we've told cart flows that when we want to create a new flow, show us templates built with Gutenberg. Let me show you how to do that now. So I'll go ahead and click on flows. I'll click on add new. And if this is the first time you've switched it to Gutenberg, it's going to do a check to see if all that we need is in place. And if not, it says click here to activate this one required plugin. So I'll go ahead and click on that and it's going to download and activate that plugin. Once it's done that, it's going to show us the templates that we have available for Gutenberg. I like this one. I'll go ahead and click on import. Okay. Now that it's imported, I'm going to add a name and click on update. Now that I've saved my funnel, you can continue using cart flows as you normally would. The only difference this time is you'll be using the built in block builder versus a page building tool. So on the landing page step here, I'll go ahead and click on edit and you can see that this page has been built with using the block builder and not using a page builder tool. And that's how you can start using cart flows with Gutenberg today. For more news and tutorials on using cart flows, click on the subscribe button and click on that notification bell. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.